Hello friends, welcome back to Owl Stack. Well, I'm back again with another no boot video. This time it is my Windows Server 2008 R2 that failed to boot with the error 0xc 00000f. It says the selected entry could not be loaded because the application is missing or corrupt. The application here is winload.exe and obvious it's missing or rather corrupt, it could not load the OS. So, to fix the problem, insert a bootable media into your machine and boot the system. Once you boot the OS, you will get the following screen which asks you whether you want to install the OS or repair it. So, just select next on this screen, install windows and select repair instead of install. On the next screen, hit next button and select command prompt. On the command prompt, type the following commands. Boot rec space forward slash fix boot. Hit enter. Boot rec space forward slash fix MBR. Boot rec space rebuild BCD. Hit enter. Okay, I typed the wrong command, so I will retype the command bootrec space forward slash rebuild. This command takes a while and looks for any Windows installation on your system. Let's wait for the Windows to complete, for the command to complete. Okay, it has completed and it says total identified Windows installation is zero. That means it did not find any installations. Now, let's run the SFC scan now to fix the problem. However, before you run the SFC command, open notepad and browse through your computer to check the current windows and boot directory. In my case, I have four drives, C drive, D drive, E. The C drive is my windows drive itself as I could see all the windows files are present in it. Okay, the drive D and the drive E are my data drives. Okay, and the drive boot X is the bootable media or the bootable drive okay make sure you check this it could be d or e in your case okay so once you confirm that go back to the command prompt and then run the following command i will close the notepad we'll go back to the command okay on the command prompt run the following command sfc space forward slash scan now space forward slash of boot dir is equal to c colon backslash in your case it could be d or e again the command space forward slash of win dir is equal to c colon backslash windows hit enter now this command takes around 8 to 10 minutes to complete okay so let's wait meanwhile if you find this video helpful please hit like and do subscribe leave a comment if there are any other errors okay Cool, the command has completed successfully. It does say that Windows Resource Protection found corrupt files and successfully repaired them. Okay, so run the following commands to fix the problem. bcd edit space forward slash export space c colon backslash bcd underscore backup. I already have bcd underscore backup on my machine. So I just type bcd underscore backup and give a random number. This command is used to export the BCD store. Now we navigate to the C drive. We get into the boot directory using the command cd space boot and then type the command attrib space bcd space hyphen s hyphen h hyphen r. This is to make sure that we can perform the rename operations on the BCD. Then type the following command ren space c colon backslash boot backslash bcd space bcd dot old. Again, I already have a bcd dot dot old. So I type bcd.old 10. Once you run the command, then you need to run those first three commands again. So that would be bootrec space forward slash fix boot, bootrec space forward slash fix MBR and bootrec space forward slash rebuild BCD. Let's wait for the rebuild BCD command to complete successfully. Okay. Okay. 
all right this time it says windows installation found on Cisco windows hit yes if you want to add it so i, I just type yeah y and hit enter and now i close the command prompt and reboot the os let's wait and watch if the command that we ran does if it helps to fix the problem if you find this video helpful please hit like and do subscribe and leave a comment if it doesn't okay looks like a standard windows boot process all right so there we go i do see the log on screen that means the issue has been fixed i hope you too find this helpful thank you so much for watching the video and have a great time ahead cheers bye